When you use HTTPS in a browser, it will usually work out of the box, no need for any configuration. And this is because browsers ship with a list of trusted certificate issuers. You can see the list here in Firefox. Options, Advanced, Certificates, and View the Certificates. So on the Authorities tab, these are the certificates that Firefox will accept, or the certificate issuers that Firefox is prepared to accept. And there they all are. As long as the website has bought and installed a certificate from one of these approved issuers, your browser will be happy. But the Oracle database has no such list of trusted certificate issuers. You have to build it up for yourself by downloading the certificates and storing them in a wallet. The first step is to tell Oracle where the trusted certificates wallet is. We do that with an entry in the SQLnet.aura file. Wallet location equals source method file. I could be using an LDAP directory, for instance, but in this case, my wallet is going to be in a file. And the method data is the location of the wallet, which will be in C colon slash TMP slash wallet. Then I need to create the directory mkdir c colon temp wallet and then finally use the oracle utility or a pkr to create the wallet when i create the wallet i give it the location of the wallet a password to open the wallet and i'm going to set it to auto login i need to obtain the certificates of the trusted certificate issuers from the website i'm going to go to so i'll browse to the oracle.com secure site and the exact technique you'll follow here will depend on the browser you're using. In Firefox this icon here will show me the details of the secure socket configuration. And here we see the certificate chain. I need to download certificates for all components of the chain, except for the leaf certificate at the very end. That's the one that will be validated when we actually make the connection. So the top level first, GeoTrust Global CA. There are various possible export formats. I find the default CRT format seems to work well enough. Then the next one in the chain export that as well and that's saved them to my local file system. To load those certificates into the wallet I'll use the Aura PKI utility again. Aura PKI wallet add and I'm going to add the certificate for GeoTrust Global CA into the nominated wallet as a trusted certificate and supply the password and do the same with the second certificate in the chain. And what wallet certificates are actually in there, the wallet display command shows me there they are as trusted certificates.